doesn't. Well, actually, I'm from Iowa, and I've lived here since the mid-90s, so I'm not the expert on the stamp at all. But, um, we have the American Shakespeare Center here, which draws a lot of theater goers. And we have um, a lot of sports people here who come to hike and camp in the Ridge Mountains. It's very beautiful here. It, it is very beautiful in the Shenandoah Valley. Right. So you've seen a lot of the scenery. Yes, it's absolutely uh, That's yeah. what brought us here, and we're very excited to go down this small town. And we were very surprised because we didn't know what to expect. Right, of course you were. It's a very quaint town. It is a cute town. The, when the railroads came through, the town got very prosperous and built a lot of buildings around the turn of the last century, around 1900. And then Stanton fell on hard times, and other small towns were rebuilt, tearing down their embarrassingly old buildings and putting up modern stores and whatever. And Stanton didn't have the money to do that. So those old buildings were still here. Well then, sometime starting around the late 70s, 1980s, people realized this is really our ace in the hole, that we have all these buildings which were crumbling and falling down, and our whole downtown is clean. And so they started to rehab it. It takes a lot of time, a lot of money, but you know, building by building, they uh, have restored the historic uh, aspect of the town. And, and there's a large uh, support here for historic residents. Uh, restoration, where the birthplace for President Woodrow Wilson was yes. present during World War One, yeah. and we have a couple of museums here, and, and all of that fits together to make staff what she is today. Well, we're very excited to get the food, uh, taste the food, it looks delicious. <laughs> I'm glad and you're here. Yeah.